with this something that you're interested in. Yes. wonderful time in here today. First and foremost, I'd like to say I'm Pamela Campbell-Boris and I'm the Chief Executive Officer of Aquaba IA. Aquaba IA means welcome. It means welcome in Ghanaian and Hindi, respectively. So, Aquaba IA. Very fast, you say it again. Aquaba Aye. Thank you very much. Okay. Uh, first and foremost, I want to thank you all for coming here today. Those of you who don't know, we at Aquaba Aye have been hosting this event for the past nine years. Within the communities that I am from, we tend to bottle things up. We tend to think we don't want nobody to know our business. But what I'm saying is, if you keep your business to yourself, everybody will know because you will break down. You will have a crisis and then everybody will know your business. So what I'm saying is, do not suffer in silence. Please seek support when you need it. And don't be ashamed. Mental health or any illness is not a curse. It's something that could happen to anyone. People do tend to think, that they would see people with mental illness and they, they, they expect it to see someone looking a certain kind of way that's got um, a machete in their, in their hands ready to kill someone. Statistics have also said that you need not be afraid of people with mental health difficulties. People with mental health difficulties is more likely to be attacked by other people as opposed to them attacking other people. So my message to you today is to seek help in a happy life. Be happier. And it's really important because it's going out into the communities and not expecting people to come to us. It brings people together in small groups and in those small groups you naturally build confidence. Or the kinds of food. You don't see that in hospitals anymore. And I think there's been, the reason for it is because people have been coming, carers and patients, to events like this and have become a lot more vocal. Do any of you this happen to anyone here? But the two types of crime that have come up a lot is fun. Let it shine, let it shine, let it shine. Exercise your body, exercise your brain, 
How can we expect change if we're acting the same way every day? Anything can lie for a time is worth working for. And there's nothing like this. Live the life you love, love the life you live, because there's nothing like this. Looking to rent an accommodation was just as difficult as finding a job. I had to walk from street to street looking. It was hard walking in those shoes, especially when you read such signs saying no Irish, no dogs, no black. Made me wonder what kind of country I'm from. Man, I tell you one morning, I put on three pairs of socks, three pairs of underpants, balak, jumps, halam and jumpers, and look over coat in which you be <laughs> Visited ten rooms that morning, one I remembered very well. Had to climb five flights of stairs, and when I did uh, leave it, I took all the heading back down the stairs, going to the place by the support. They said, listen to the streets that the paid me go. The cynics, the story that's never been told. Jumped up the high, the touch, the low. It has to be challenged. And uh, the, the situation we have, which is still right in many communities, is that uh, there's a lot of stigma, a lot of stereotyping. Uh, and the derogatory words which are used to label people has to be challenged. Uh, and uh, we need to work together. Currently, the voluntary sector is going through serious, challenging times. Oh, happy day. Oh, happy day. Oh, happy day. Oh, happy day.